Hello everyone, this is Teacher Mission. So our subject for today is health for Platon 2 or P2. So today, I will discuss to you about promoting good health. So last time, we are finished about being healthy. This time, we will move on about choosing healthy food. Number three is avoiding appliances and toys which can be harmful to health. To promote good health, you need to choose healthy foods. What are these healthy foods? You need to eat a wide variety of healthy foods. For example, fruits like apples, grapes, oranges, strawberries, and many more. We also have vegetables like asparagus, broccoli, and many more like eggplant. We also have eggs, meats, and don't forget to drink milk. These are unhealthy foods. For example, candies, ice creams, french fries, burgers. These are examples of healthy foods, and we have principles for choosing healthy food. First, you need to choose healthy foods according to the three B's principles. What are these? First, being beneficial. The first B is choose food. Choose food that are having nutrients. So these are examples of foods that are nutritious. Fruits, vegetables, dairies that have proteins. So these are the five food groups. We have the dairy group, grains group, protein foods group, vegetable group, and fruit group. First, dairy group. What are the foods that we can see in the dairy group? We have here milk, cheese, yogurt, and many more. How about the grain groups? Grain groups like rice and breads. We also have protein groups. What are the foods that you can see in the protein groups? We have here meat, chicken, eggs, and seafoods like shrimp and lobster. Next is the vegetable groups. You can see there onion, eggplant, broccoli, and tomato, and different kinds of vegetables. Next is the fruit group. What are the different fruits that you can see in the fruit group? We also have here strawberry, oranges, mangoes, bananas, watermelon, and many more kinds of fruit. So these are the five food groups. Dairy group, grains group, protein group, vegetable group, and fruit group. Number two is being safe. Choose food with no harmful ingredients or germs. For example, we have the chips, foods that have flies. These are not healthy foods because it can cause stomach ache or diarrhea. Number 3B is being inexpensive or reasonable. What do you mean by this? You need to choose food that is being sold according to its season. For example, we have fruits and vegetables. It is cheap and can be found easily. Aside from three B's, we also have three S's principles. The first S is save nutrients. Food should be cooked correctly. For example, you need to mix well the vegetables in cooking it. Next S is stay cooked. 
these are the foods that are fully cooked for for example we have steak this is the color of the steak that is undercooked or not cooked correctly this is the color of the steak that is fully cooked it is color brown or dark brown it is ready to eat the last s is stay clean utensils and food should be clean and fresh for example when you are cooking vegetable you need to wash it properly and just like the fruit before eating it you wash it properly to remove the germs in it also wash the pots or utensils that you use when cooking another one is avoid eating too much sweet food just like chocolate avoid also food that is too much sour foods that are salty and foods that are so spicy like noodles spicy noodles why because it can cause kidney failure these are examples of unhealthy food another one is avoid foods that are fermented what are these food these are the food that is stored in one bottle for a long time for example one month why because it can cause stomach ache or diarrhea another one is avoid crispy foods examples are the sausages fried chickens and french fries it can cause kidney failure and it can make your body fat or overweight avoid colorful foods what are these colorful foods we have ice creams and candies we also have the different kinds of drinks that are very colorful that are not good to our health so you need to avoid these colorful foods number eight sugary soft drinks cause weight gain and diabetes these are examples of sugary soft drinks like 7up coca-cola pepsi and many more this time you need to download the worksheet by scanning the qr code all you have to do is to write the five different food groups what are the different food groups for example the vegetable group you write in number one and then you can see an arrow under the foods you need to write examples of food that you can see in the vegetable group for example you can see there pepper you write the word in the food groups so thank you for listening this is teacher michelle